The stream today is all about how to create some holiday promo to promote your products. But I'm gonna show you two ways to do it. I'm gonna show you how to do it in Premiere Pro. And if you're not so familiar with Premiere Pro, I'll show you how you can do it in Adobe Express. I wanted to create a Christmas card for dog lovers, Merry Stinkmas, because oh, dogs are stinky, but yes, they that's are. okay. So, all right, I created this new sequence. This is 60 frames per second, 1080, 1920. Something I like to do is go to firefly.adobe.com mm -hmm. and I do use text to image to generate some background. So let's go right here, describe the image you wanna generate. Bright awesome. snowy background image close up with pine trees peeking in for a flat lay photo. Perfect, so I downloaded that and all I did was I dragged this folder right into this project and I was able to have all these background assets loaded into Premiere. Awesome. So I'm dragging that in. I want it to be like, not so even maybe. So I'm gonna rotate it just a bit using the Premiere video properties. I'm gonna extend it to 15 seconds. In this case, I'm just gonna import the product that I wanna showcase, right? And I'm going to just scale it. I'm gonna extend it the whole way through. I personally think social video is really good when you have a person in it. You wanna tell people like why they might want to buy this. Now I'm going to show you this funny video and that I made. these are all taken in, on your phone. phone. These, I just did it on my phone. I was trying to show yeah. you guys like, you don't have to have like a super high tech yeah. setup. So I'm making like a cheesy ad for my products. I want you guys to keep that in mind. So, so that's the video that I made and I'm never out of the frame. Okay. And I think that's something important if you're going to try and replicate something like this, which I hope you do. I'm going to drag this in and then I want to basically green screen myself. To do this, you just right click and then we're gonna do replace with After Effects composition. So now we're opening After Effects. Do not be scared. I will lead the way. Roto brush right up here. You wanna select that. So I just want to use this and select and now it's going to render that and, and grab it. And once I um, rotoscope myself out using the linked After Effects composition, I just added some simple keyframes here to keyframe that video layer going in. And then the same thing with the video layer going out. Uh -huh. And yeah, so this is kind of the long way. Are you looking for the <laughs> like, it's dog? funny, but it's really tidy, like all the edges. And now I'm gonna show you what we could do if we head on over to Adobe Express. So new.express.adobe.com and you can do new and then go down to Instagram Reel. So from here, I'm going to add the background. If you click on media, you go upload from device. Have this one, I'm just gonna open it, select it, hit option and shift and scale from the center. If I go to my stuff and mm -hmm. I created that holiday card in Photoshop. Okay. So instead of uploading the PNG export of the Photoshop, I'm just gonna link the Photoshop file. If you end up down the line updating that file, it will reflect in your video, which is great. I'm going to add some more elements. So here I had the snowflake element that I created, and this is just a Photoshop file that only has this in it. I held uh, option and selected and dragged, and now I have two of them, okay. Now I'm going to go to media, upload from device, and I'm going to upload the spectacular footage of me floating in promoting my product. Once your video loads, you get this beautiful little button here, remove background, and you click this button, boom. Here you kind of get simple animation, but it's fast and it might be just enough for what you're doing. Yeah. So I'm gonna do in and I'm gonna do this button. Well, we have a lot of options and it's really funny when you're animating yourself. I'm leading in to the vibe that we're going for, so I'm gonna hit tumble. If I select the tumble out, I can pick which direction I tumble out. Now, mm -hmm. let's animate the card because the card is the thing we're trying to sell. So if we head over to animation, we then do in, <laughs> let's say I want the card to maybe grow. Yes, that looks good. But maybe I want this to bob, right? So it's like floating in the space of this mm. uh, flat lay. I can also then animate these snowflakes. Just select, hit animation. I'm just gonna say spin. You should always have text when you're doing some promotion for your products because text keeps people on the screen just a little longer, right? So I'm gonna hit add text and I'm gonna say stinky dog approved. I'm gonna change the fill to be this cream color. I can add shapes right in here and then customize the color of these shapes. Mm -hmm. Now I can also edit the shape size. So I'm gonna do awesome. like right around there. Here I'm just pressing option and selecting to get a duplicate. And then this one, I'm gonna have it be a different color. 
I want to animate this, you can. So I'm going to do that and I'm going to do the same to this one here. So mm, I love that. If you were done here, you could just hit download, selected page MP4 because you're going to upload this as a video and you would hit right. download yeah. and you're good to go. Okay, so here I have exported the Premiere version on the left mm -hmm. and the Adobe Express version on the right. Thank you, Fabiola. This is great. I learned so much and I hope for everybody else, um, y'all got some really cool insights. Bye.